I have a devstack setup. This is my local RC file. Inside this uh, devstack folder, you can see stack.sh script. We can use this stack.sh script to install OpenStack services and you can also use it for reinstall all OpenStack services. Then unstack.sh. You can use this script to stop all running services. Then rejoin stack.sh. You can use this script to uh, st start all services again. Let me run this rejoin stack.sh. Actually, devstack uses sc screen to uh, start all services. So let me run this rejoin stack.sh script. So this is a screen. So in the bottom, you can see that screen tabs. For each for each service, you can see a tab here. If you want to list all tab, you can use Control I. Double quotes. These are the tabs. Here you can see for each service, for each keystone, uh, for each OpenStack service, there is a tab. Let me go to keystone tab so right now i am in keystone tab so here you can see the keystone log here if you want to stop this keystone service you can use you can press ctrl c now i stop the keystone service then if you want to start the service press up arrow so now you can see the command which used to used to run the keystone then press enter so now I started the keystone again okay if you want to go to the next next tab for example the horizon tab you can use the key control a n if you want to go back to the previous step, you can use Ctrl A P. Okay, you can also use a number. If you want to go to the tab five, you can use Ctrl A five. Now I am in tab five. Okay, if you want to go to the previous step, you can use the you can press the Ctrl A toys control a control a control a control a this way you can toggle between the tabs so if you want to close this screen window you can use control a d so let me show some some more screen commands for example screen minus ls This will list all screens screen sessions exist in this system. So right now it has only one screen session running. So if you want to open that screen session, you can use the command screen minus X. Okay. If you have a multiple screen session running in this system, you have to specify the screen name. For that, we, we, have, we can use the minus R option. Screen minus R. Then the name of the screen. In this case, this is the name of the screen. This way you can open that screen session. If you want to exit from here you can use ctrl a then plus d okay 
so this way then if you want to kill a screen session you can use control a shift k then if you want to this i already explained move, go to the next tab and go to the previous tab if you want to list the name of all name of all um, screen tabs you can use control a double quotes so this way you can list all screen tabs so if you want to toggle you can use control i control i then so let me go to the keystone tab so here you can see the keystone log suppose you want to copy some text from this log so for that you can use this keys control i then open square bracket control i open square bracket you can see the copy mode then press enter then use the arrow up and down arrow key to select the test then press enter again then 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 press control a close square bracket control a close bracket so i copied that text so if you want to paste it paste this uh, test in some file you can do that let me open one file here f1 and you can paste it here just press the cross square bracket control a control a uh, sorry control a close square, square bracket so this way you can paste that text okay let me exit from this file and actually i stop the keystone let me start it again okay how to restart a service that i already explained uh, if you want to key, uh, restart keystone can press control go to the keystone tab then press control c now it stop then press up arrow then press enter similarly if you want to stop uh, heat engine go to the heat engine tab then press control c if you want, then press up arrow to start then press enter now I started the services service again okay but you cannot restart the horizon this way you cannot restart the horizon because horizon using apache to serve the page so you have to restart apache if you want to if you are making some change in the horizon you have to restart the apache here you can see only the horizon logs so if you press ctrl c and up arrow here you can see it's, it's only it's doing the tail of this dog nothing it's not using any command only the log but if you go to some other log some other tab and press ctrl c you can see is using some command for example in, the, in this case it's using the keystone all command to run the keystone okay so this way you can use this screen to debug uh, your open stack setup so you can see the log here and you can start and stop the services so it is 
uh, you can use it for your Apple stack development. Let me close it. <coughs> 